Hi, this is Philip in the Austin, Texas office, and I'm just finishing up the design of a part using SolidWorks 2017. In the past couple years, I've seen the fillet tool become increasingly powerful, and I'm glad to say that 2017 brings the same level of power and control to the chamfer. I'm going to start off by making a new offset face chamfer type and making multiple distant chamfers all at the same time. All I have to do to do this is simply click on the edges inside of my model that I'd like to chamfer and notice the on-screen callouts. For each selection I can change the size so maybe I need smaller chamfers on the inside and larger chamfers on the outside. After I'm happy with the different sizes simply hit the green check and in one feature I've made multiple chamfers of different sizes. But it gets much more powerful than that. Let's make a large change to this part design. So I'm going to roll back before shell feature and just use two faces using the face to face chamfer type to define a fillet. I can use a standard value or if I want to take this further even use a hold line selecting two edges to control the depth or size of the chamfer. Now with one feature I've got a chamfer that changes in size and wraps all the way around my part. Although to be honest I probably should have just used a fillet from the start. And that's okay, I don't need to delete this feature. I can simply edit it and change any chamfer to a fillet or vice versa. Making a curvature continuous fillet looks great on this part. And rolling to the end, I've now got something pretty complex that looks good inside and out.